Hey, what's up guys? Diplexer again. Welcome to Colombia. That is right. Here is a user submitted map, uh, you know, sent to me by a guy called George. Thank you very much, man. I appreciate it. This is some stunning work. I really like the map so far. He has also prepared a mission for us. We are doing a Colombian drug raid uh, or a drug assault or whatever you want to call it. Uh, we're, we're, it's like a cartel, uh, the Medellin cartel here in Colombia that is being attacked by the Colombian army. Um, I think the Colombian army was, was is mainly responsible for the, the operations against these guys since they're so heavily armed and uh, and I mean, they're... they're the, you know the drug lords got a lot of money they can they can build themselves uh, private armies and equip them really well so i'm just excited to see how this is going to be uh in reality i also think there's like a mix of of special police and, and army units who, who fight these cartels um but yes and i think uh, that's the right way to say it. you don't say medellin you say medellin right not medellin there's two l's in spanish so it's medellin right um, anyway, uh, if you guys want to watch more, go see Narcos on uh, Netflix. It's an amazing series. I just came to think of that. I, I saw all 10 or 11 or I don't even know how many episodes. Uh, just uh, just over a couple of days before, and it's just a stunning series. So if you have Netflix and you're into to drug lords and, and um, cool fights and shit and uh, stuff like that, then go ahead and watch that. But now we're going to watch this. We're going to take the Colombian forces here. We're going to split our waves into different attacks here and we're gonna go ahead and land using these rib boats we're coming here from a river so this is in present day and we're just gonna land around here and assault the the cartel position uh, look at these drug lords got a guy in there as well so it's gonna be pretty cool I'm uh, I'm excited so once again stunning map great work let's just enjoy the scenario and have some fun uh, now the rib boats don't have a sound to them I, I know it's it's kind of weird but that's just how it is Actually, I'm going to have you two guys approach that side. And the the gunners will be kept in the boats for supportive fire. We also have some choppers, helicopters back there that we can pull in. Uh, really excited to use some of those guys. <coughs> going up on a Tuesday. All right, let's go. Move. Now, these guys are going to speak Spanish. There's some Spanish voice files for them, so that's really cool. I think the soldiers themselves are, are kind of based off the, the Cuban faction. Uh, I don't believe there is a Colombian faction in the game right now. Preparados. Si, sí, señor. Sí, señor. I don't know what he says. It sounds like preparados or something. That's <laughs> really cool. So we're going to hear some Spanish shouts pretty soon. Cool stuff, guys. Cool stuff. Okay, these guys are going to assault here, that little small outpost to the left. This here is the main drug facility. I guess they're doing the refinery and all the operations in there. Now, it's pretty well defended. A lot of AKs. Oh, these guys are like, what the fuck is that? Oh, we're under attack. Look at these guys. Look at these narcos, huh? Actually, yeah, narcos, isn't that like the, the, the police who deal with them? Or is that the people who, who deal with the drugs? <laughs> there we go, guys. Attack. Oh, there's going to be firefight here in the jungle. It's it's cool. Reminds me of a scene from Narcos. It's just stunning. Oh. Oh, they got guns everywhere in the houses and buildings and everything. Holy shit. We're under heavy fire. Taking heavy casualties. Holy shit. Oh. Whoop. Whoop. Uh. So damn hard to get a hold of that chopper. Fuck it. Just do it like this. <laughs> there we go. We're one down. Enforcement's coming in. We're going to launch some rockets into that building. Fire! Oh. oh, we're shot down. What the? F Whoa, I have no idea what happened. We could have hit the end of a building. I don't think we did. I just think we got knocked out. Oh, those pilots are going to be receiving some heavy fire. That's really unfortunate. So, hoping here that our boats provide enough cover. Let's call in the next wave. We're going to need some more backup to take this on. We're probably going to need that second chopper. Uh, we're going to land one section back there to the left. So, yeah, some rib boat sounds would be cool. That would be great. Also, the broken textures have sort of more or less been fixed. Um, found a, uh, <coughs> or a guy called... Alexander there sent me uh, like a fix for that. I think it works with the 
Red Rising team. So that's all all really good. Okay, so we lost about an entire section trying to assault here. The cartel members here were, were good in their defense, but they've lost quite a lot too. Now we're going for this main headquarters back here, and it's really well defended. The two pilots back here, not sure what they want to do, but they're actually unarmed, so I have no idea what we can do. We can we can hide them <laughs> by a building and hope, hope they're going to stay okay. Or, or they're going to run around. They're getting shot at like crazy. I'm surprised they're still there. Uh, let's do a little gun run on this. And that's going to sound weird, a gun run. It's not what you'd probably imagine. But what I'm thinking of is taking these boats. Or at least one of them. And then hitting this section up back here. There we go. That's nice. That's really cool. This boat got stuck on the way there. It's going to move. Water is always a little tricky in this game. Alright, we're making our way there. Let's go. We've landed quite a few troops now. We want to try and keep casualties at a minimum. There are a lot of cartel members remaining. Covering fire. Right, let's uh, pull in that second chopper. The guy spawned us with three. We lost one, obviously. That's me messing around with him. But uh, we're going to go ahead and spawn another one to replace the one that we lost. Somewhere out there in the wilderness of this map. Coming in for another gun run. Oh, that was sick. We hit him up real good. Oh, rockets. It's like Apocalypse Now. I didn't even utilize them. Commander guy there from the other seat fired. That's sick. Oh. We've lost pilots, I think. We're going to hit this place up here as well. <laughs> yes. Firepower. Sweet. Have this chopper circulate around here for now. There's a guy hiding right there. Move, move. Now, let's just take these guys for additional troops. We're not going to use the 50s back here anymore. Oh, this chopper's acting on its own. What is it doing? What is it doing? I didn't tell you to go around and circulate in here. Maybe I did. If I did, I didn't mean to, okay? Sorry, you can go back. He was all excited. He was like, oh, Thank you. <laughs> Alright. Moving up some more guys here. Taking a couple of... Oh my lord, we got cut down. I didn't even notice this. Trying to enter here, and this guy in the building probably took us all out. I understand why the choppers have been deployed here. It is hard to actually take this place. Let's go ahead and utilize them. Coming in for another gun run. Oh, too close, too close for comfort. A lot of troops in the back area there. It's going to be danger close, but we're coming in with another strike. Wish I spoke a little Spanish. I don't. It would have been much cooler if I did. Oh, cut two down. That was sick. These little special missions are awesome. This is so fucking cool. This is really well done. George, make me another one. Another map, another mission. Your your uh your free choice of scenario, of course. This is good stuff. Oh bat ambush! Get a couple of nades in there. Smoke this sucker out. Something tells me he's gone. That was one nade out there just to make sure he's dead and gone. And this vehicle, is he trying to escape? Can you just go up and shoot him in the face? There we go. Freaking executed. Now we got some more uh, militia back here in the jungle. Still reloading the rockets, but we're going to try and do a strafing run and take him out. They're kind of hard to spot. Soldiers. Drug soldiers, huh? 
Ah, yes. What a gun run. Doing good. Knocking him out. Okay, we're going to go back and refuel at base. Good stuff, good stuff. Let's line some of these guys back up here. Let's grab some of these guys to try and take out this little village here. We don't want to use the choppers too much. We obviously lost one already that got shot down. Pilots are alive. Something t tells me the pilots have been put on harmless. Um... Uh, yeah, impregnability full, which means that they can't be killed. I, that's a great idea when you're, you know, adding choppers to the game. Because people get shot down in the helicopters way too easily, which means that when they die, the chopper crashes. But you can always still shoot down the vehicle. The vehicle is not uh, invincible. The, the, the pilots are. That guy got cut down. How these pilots arm themselves, at least? Come down here and grab an AK or something. Okay, so casualty report still just quite a few army members around here. It's been a it's been a deadly battle here. One of one that one that will go into the history book of Colombian drug war or of the Colombian drug war. We've lost a couple of more troops assaulting up here. This is still just really freaking cool. Vamos, vamos, vamos. Vamos. Policía. Tropa de élite. We're getting cut down back here. We're losing contact. Going now. Did these guys grab guns now? This guy has. That's sick. Come back here, dude. Grab a gun. You don't even have to tell them. They'll just grab them. Automatically. Going up mm, on a Tuesday. It's a Wednesday today, though. Well, <clears throat> take uh, an M16A1. Why not? And also, why don't you grab that bazooka? That bazooka. Is it money? Holy shit, there's just a bunch of money here in a stack. We got the stacks of the money. Should we blow it up? Yes, I think so. Fucking missed it, dude. What a bummer. All right, we'll have another go at that. Let's watch as the firefight continues. That'll be a little finishing Easter egg there. Look at this pilot. He's just beasting it. Okay, they're they're done here. Let's do an attack move right here. That means they're going to stop and obviously engage everyone on their way there. Before they get there, I really want to take this money, pile of money out and see everything just fly. We might just crash the game. Look at the money! The money! Loads of money! Mm. Okay. We're coming in. In a chopper. We're gonna send a couple rockets down your way. Fuck yes. That's it. Over and out. We're out of ammo. We're going back to base. Can we take this turret down? The tower? That's indestructible. I figured it's way too nice of a looking uh, model to be destructible. But there we go. We have successfully cleared out this little cartel base. Not all too many soldiers remaining, but we are good. We are the elite. Look here. I count probably at least 30, 40, 50 uh, cartel losses and at least the same amount, at least the same amount in, in, uh, in our losses. The soldiers, we just got cut down. I think uh, if I did this again, I would spread out more. We obviously were a little too bunched up, but I never, I didn't know they had so many troops. I thought there were a couple people in here, but they were stacking the buildings and it kind of, kind of caught us in an, in a, in a, in an outrage. The government is outraged about this whole, uh, ordeal with all these cartel members causing so much problem here. Anyway, guys. Yes. Thank you guys for watching, of course. And uh, I'll see you guys in an upcoming video pretty soon. It'll be, uh, we're going to do some absolute pressure, which you guys will probably enjoy. More Star Wars, of course. More Red Rising. Probably some Dark Sentara, too. And uh, until then, you guys enjoy. Bye.